Oh, are you guys in line for tickets? Uh, Genting Highlands. I'm trying to get to the Awana bus terminal. Awana? Yes? Next bus, 330. Next bus, 330. Oh, 3.30? Okay, all right. Hello, hi. I just need one to the Genting uh, Highlands, the Awana bus terminal. Just one. They got the, they got the tiniest little... Ten? Okay. Okay, thank you. Good afternoon, everybody. Tater here. Uh, as you probably have gathered, I'm on my way to the Genting Highlands. Uh, I'm going to take a bus here shortly, 3.30 uh, p.m. to be specific. All the way up to, I believe it is the Awana bus terminal. And from there, we will be taking a nice cable car or a tram, however you want to say it. I've actually never been on one of those, so that should be pretty fun. For now, I'm hanging out in KL Central. Uh, this is the main transportation hub here in Kuala Lumpur. And uh, basically, you can get a train to anywhere except for where I'm going. So we're taking a bus. That's the idea anyway. A whole 10 ringgit for a ticket, so roughly two US dollars for a one hour bus ride. And then we will be onward to our destination, Genting Highlands. This is apparently more of, you know, fancier. Uh, kind of like a resort destination. They have a casino, a, an amusement park. I'm after some of the amusement myself, so we're going to be making sure to get on a few roller coasters. That's the idea anyway. But I'm going to hang out for now uh, until my bus is ready, and then we're going to be on our way. Genting? Oh, Genting, Highlands, yeah. Uh, Awana, I believe. Uh, Awana? Yeah. Uh, KLSM. Huh? Uh, that's that's what mine says, yeah, KLSM, yeah. Okay. Thank you. Oh, thank you. Good, thank you. Four, okay, nice. Well, they got me on the solo side even, look at that. Beautiful. Very colorful seat. Yeah, what do you guys think? Hmm? Now, this is the first bus I've seen with an actual full full seat belt. It's interesting. Comes with a built in armrest, even. We're chilling. Oh, there we go. I think we're off, everybody. Bye bye. But yeah, I'd say this is a pretty nice bus for two dollars. Are you kidding me? Ten ringgit? I guess it's a little more than two dollars technically. You know, at two twenty or something like that. But it's nice. Very colorful. I don't know. I like I like the old purple and orange and blue designs. These wonderful chairs. But uh, we'll say goodbye to the city for now, and we're gonna head for higher ground. It started to rain there for a bit, but uh, the sun is coming back out and we are starting to climb up this mountain here. I think we're making good time. Listen, I see some blue up there, okay? There's still hope. There's still hope, everybody. I think that we are... Yeah, I think we're coming up on the, on the place right now. <laughs> I get off to get on my little tram cart thing. Okay, just gonna grab my bag. One way back in there. for, yeah, the Skyway. This way to the Skyway. All right, and so I actually already bought my ticket from Kluke. So, hoping this will be pretty easy. Assuming it's up. 
I would guess that it's up. Yes. Here we go. It's okay. Do I, do I scan it here? Yeah, but glass floor. Glass oh, floor. I have to go over there? Uh, Which way? Glass. Yeah, glass. glass oh, here? Okay. Oh, okay. Yeah, I can't read. Ah, easy. Look at that. Thank you so much. All right, so yeah, I get a special a special line because I ordered the train or the see I get a special line or something because I got one with a glass floor you can kind of you can see them lining up over there so should be an adventure we get to see a nice cloudy rainy beautiful day I see the sun that counts okay so there's a there seems like a big line for the for the standard one, but not as big of a one for for the OG or the the glass one. So it is an additional, you know, two dollars. I think I paid a total of twenty ringgits. So we're getting close to the front of the line here. It took I don't know, maybe an extra twenty minutes or so. I think I I saw about maybe seven thousand people go ahead of me uh, in the normal line, but it's okay. We're hanging out. We're waiting. Oh, okay. Interesting. It's a long way up there. Let's, are, are we going together? You guys want to go with and be solo? How do you want to do? Yeah, so, you are the glass floor, right? Yeah, glass floor. But I'm solo, so I don't know if I should take up a whole one by myself. That seems a little selfish. But, uh, but if you guys want to go alone... You can take six at a time. Oh, okay, six. All right. Well, I mean, that's six normal people, right? Yeah. yeah I got the big belly, so... <laughs> Thumbs up, all right, brother. There you go. I point the camera right back at him, okay? Fight fire with fire. You pay extra, you wait an extra 30 minutes or something. Exactly. Yeah. <laughs> I think next time I'm taking the other one. Okay. <laughs> it's pretty peaceful. I'll give you a little view from the back. Yeah, there, but, uh, where yeah. we're headed from. I mean, it is gorgeous. Beautiful place. Excuse me. Hmm? I'll take a photo for you guys. Yeah, sure, yeah. sure. Why not? Hold on. Hold on for a second. All right. Take one more. One more. You guys are too handsome. Okay. <laughs> Get that. All right. All right. I took a few. Thank so, you. Of course, brother. Of course. Where are you guys from? Pakistan. Pakistan. Oh, wow. Long way, huh? Yeah. I'm a uh, USA, so. Very long way. Yeah, very long way. <laughs> very long. <laughs> oh, got some type of yeah, tower train. coming up on the way. Like that. I don't got a PhD. <laughs> That's awesome, brother. Congratulations, you know. Wow. 
It is absolutely beautiful. It's definitely worth it to take the take the rail car, okay? But but maybe not maybe not the glass one. Okay, you gotta wait extra. Let's uh, <laughs> state are you from? Hmm? Which state of America? State? Uh, California. California. So. so you are basically from Hollywood area? Uh, something like that, yeah. <laughs> but, but between Hollywood and uh, San Francisco. I, I'm in between. I'm in between. Where out in, in Pakistan are you from? From the Zamba. capital. Hmm? From the capital, the Samba. Oh, okay. All right, awesome. So you'll be here how, how many years? Four? Uh, six? Yeah. Uh, my PSC is for three years, but oh, three years. I've been here from the past nine, ten months now. Oh, okay. Awesome. So my my friends were missing me, so that's why. Ah, so you, you, so you came to keep them company. Yeah, I like yeah, it. I like yeah. it. I like it. How do you how do you like uh, here in Malaysia? It's good. Uh, yeah, it's good. But actually, I'm uh, in Kalantan area, the western side of of Malaysia. Ah, okay, okay. So that is kind of pretty. Uh, have you visited Parhantian? I have not. No, I've just been to down in Kuala Lumpur. So you should visit Parhantian Island. Okay. It's, it's on that side. So I've heard that. Uh, Ooh, coming it's, in hot. It's a beautiful area. Ah, okay. All right, I'll check it out. You can kind of see it through the raindrops over there, but I see some roller coasters, a little ice age area, I guess. I love all the colors and everything. Everything looks very so colorful. Right? Oh, I think we might be, we'll be coming in hot. There we go. Smooth man. Yeah, smooth. Alright. Nice to meet you guys. Have a nice holiday. Alright. All right, we're out of here, everybody. Not a bad little rail car ride. Not so bad. Like I said, I don't know. The glass floor, you pay a little extra. It's not worth the wait. That's my my personal opinion. But I got to I got to hang out with some nice guys from Pakistan. So that's always good. PhD, nonetheless. This must be the indoor Sky Avenue type of theme park place. So. You can see all types of adventures are, yeah, are awaiting. Apparently there's a shuttle here that will take me to my hotel, uh, Mag Tree. It's actually pretty far away uh, from this spot here. But I mean, oh, this place is absolutely gorgeous. Look at this, all these fancy lights and everything. I'm stepping into the future. <laughs> An interesting little trip there, you know. Some nice guys from Pakistan. Uh, very friendly. But we're trying to like, you know, like do like little 360s around each other and get photos and stuff like that, take selfies and always fun, okay? That's what you, that's the best part. Best part about traveling is you get to get those little experiences right there. But, uh, okay, I gotta find my way out of here and I gotta go find a shuttle. Let's see, let's see where I can go. I imagine because I imagine most people will be going to the indoor theme park right now because it's been raining all night. But uh, hopefully we'll get some, some clear days while I'm here. We can go check out some coasters. But I gotta go, I somehow, I managed to find it somehow. Hello, uh, it's a mag tree, yes? Yes. Sir. Okay, all right, it's six? Yeah. Okay. Uh, later. Oh, oh, collect later? Okay. Thank you. Right. Uh, another small bus. <coughs> Hello. Hello. <coughs> Squeeze back here, excuse me. Okay. Oh, man. They've got the fanciest buses. The most colorful seats. One last trip, everybody. This is what travel's like, all right? It takes a while to get places, longer than you think, okay? I left my hotel at 12 this morning, and it's now 5.30, so it's a, it's a one-hour bus ride away. <laughs> Kita nggak tahu nih tutup ternyata oh, Skyward. Oke, okay, 
Yeah. Very good. Thank you very much. Mag tree tower two. Okay. Do you, where do I go? Just inside first and tower two. Okay. Yeah. Thank you. Okay. Very helpful. He already knew I was lost. You can see, you can see it in my eyes. <laughs> Excuse me, sir. Mag tree. Right in here. Okay. Thank you. Uh, reservation for uh, Jacob Kempel. Passport there. Nice looking lobby. Oh, there he is. Thank you. I found it, brother. Thank you. <laughs> okay. The room will be at Tower 7, mm -hmm. level 25. 18 is your room number. Okay, fantastic. Uh, you are now in Tower 2. Okay. Here. Okay, so we're here and I'm going to seven. Ah, yes. Okay. Uh, All you right. can use the lift up there, go okay. to level three, okay. and then follow the sky bridge. Mm -hmm. You will reach at tower seven. Okay, fantastic. Uh, for the Wi Fi? Oh, we got <laughs> user, more. All right. Username mm -hmm. uh, is your room number, okay. password, your name, small capital letter. Okay, small yeah, but, capital uh, for for now, mm -hmm. all the server of the Wi-Fi in Genting mm -hmm. is down. Okay, so Wi-Fi uh, down. Yeah, I need okay. to wait for a All right, all right. Okay, fantastic. Thank you so much. Thank you. All right, have a good day. All right, so that's good. At least when I, you know, can't figure out the Wi-Fi, I, I know who to blame, and it's it's finally not me. <laughs> uh, all right, so one more trek. I said take the lift to level three. Then we're going to Tower 7. It is quite a, quite a complex they got going on here. Ah, I see, okay, so three is the Sky Garden as well. So we get to walk through the Sky Garden. Oops, no! I got a little excited. Pressed an extra button. So, okay, yeah, so three is they have a kitchen, swimming pool, and a gym. Wonderful. All right, and this is where we came in at. Not a lot of construction going on, but it still looks gorgeous. We got the sun coming through. Guest rooms, Tower 7, through this little area here. Oh. I can, get, I can go to the playground if I want to, guys. Fantastic, okay. Oh. I'm just gonna take a little peek out here real quick, just to see. We got some gorgeous fountains out here. Beautiful, looks like uh, Oasis Pool Bar. So we have a bar to check out at some point, if we, if we do so desire. Okay, 25, so we're way up there. What is the order of these numbers? Guys, am I? Oh, 25. I don't know why, but my brain just had a stroke looking at those numbers there. Okay. <laughs> Oh yeah. We can, we can get everybody. Are you you? Excuse me. I'll, I'll squeeze through. It's okay. Excuse me. Bule coming through. All right. <laughs> I I heard I heard him. <laughs> Check this room out if I can. Okay. All right. Now. All right. Power on, everybody. 
This is our room here, and we'll check it out real quick. Yes, I did get twin beds, even though I am forever alone. Uh, if anything, I'll just, you know, push them together or something like that. But uh, not so bad. Not so bad. It was cheaper, so I was like, you know, that's a couple bucks cheaper. Why not? This is our, our view out here. They got me pretty high up here, 25th floor. Looking pretty nice. I get this um, little construction area to, to gander at. Interesting. It's like a little scrap pit or something with a crane. I like it, okay. They're doing a lot of construction, so it makes sense. But uh, you get a little bit of the tower, uh, a little bit of the hotels and stuff over there. A little, some, uh, I don't know, cell towers to look at. I like it. I like it. But, uh, you know, pretty basic. A nice little desk here. Comfy looking chair. I don't know. We got, we got the, you know, Nescafe Classic. And um, I have this peculiar painting. I don't know why, but when I look at it, I feel like it needs to be like rotated. Am I crazy? Or maybe the other way. You know, let's take a gander at this bathroom. Looks pretty nice. We got the fancy mirror with the light built into it. Um, is this one of those zooming ones? It's not. Of course, the old, the old hair dryer. Fabulous. But, uh, you know, standard amenities. And uh, nice looking shower though. A little waterfall. Is it? Okay, oh, it just, it takes a minute for it to run up there. Okay, and then we got an ironing board, stellar. Of course, you got the safe, some slippers, and um, my dearest enemy there. <laughs> I'll be honest, I have never seen a scale in a hotel room. I'll test out this bed real quick and see what's going on. Ooh. It's a lot firmer than I would have guessed. But it's actually not bad, we'll see. We will see all types of adventures to get up to. All right, so I uh, settled in. I'm gonna go downstairs and grab some food from that it's like a little bar restaurant right in front of the, uh, I don't know, the pool area with the, uh, with the big block. Not this way, this way. I don't know. If it's busy or not, we'll see. They got some type of, I don't know, something banquet dinner or something going on over there. It smells pretty good. And then, uh, yeah, now it's all lit up again out here. Looks pretty nice. Pretty chill looking place, but I'm mostly here for some food. That's the idea anyway. Now what we got going on for a quick dinner? Um, Asian, Western, fast, casual. Um, I'm not really feeling like any Western food, everybody. Why don't we go with the Daka Mi Goreng with shrimps? That sounds pretty, pretty all right. Hi there, uh, could I please get the uh, N4, the Daka Mi Goreng with shrimp? Yeah, N4. And then, could I also get uh, Q10? Q10. Yes. Hmm? I haven't. Yeah. And then I don't know. What do you. Where are the drinks? Oh. Right here? Okay. Uh, can I just get. Can I get a cold Thai milk tea? Sure, yeah. Uh, cold, yeah. yeah. Cash only? Cash only? Okay. 68. 68. Yeah. Okay. Oops. I only, have one, I only have one hand, sorry. It's a bit more complicated. All right, thank you so much. Uh, I'm going to go hang out over here. I'm going to go hide in the corner, like the, like the caveman that I am. All right, so the tea, this DACA station Thai milk tea, 
ended up, I think this was 20 ringgit by itself, so this is a $4 thing of tea. I mean, it is pretty flippin' tasty. Normally I'm not one to be paying $4 for a drink, but that's that's actually pretty good. So this is why it's called the pool bar. It's because the pool's like right in there. So maybe we can go check that out. I was gonna choose the Nasi Lamont because I still have yet to try that yet, but I am hell-bent on trying it in the city, on the street, you know. I, I think things taste better that way, so. Once we get back into Kuala Lumpur, that is my goal, is to go find some Nasi Lamak and uh, chow down. Hell yeah! All right. Awesome. Thank you very much, Thank brother. You. What do you think about that, huh? Got my wonderful tray of food here. A little shrimp pasta with an egg. And then even more eggs, all right? We're going going all out on the eggs, everybody. All right, I mean, look at this flipping. The eggs always look so good here. And then, of course, a big old pile of noodles, some big old chunks of shrimp. I'm always surprised. They leave the tails on here a lot, I've noticed. And then, of course, this beautiful-looking omelet, a little onion in there, you know? Let's just give this a shot real quick. A little extra cooked on the bottom. But, you know, I, okay, we're taking it off of the tray, everybody, because it's just gonna spin, I guess, if I do that. <laughs> Cheers, everybody. Big old piece. It's delicious. What do you expect? But yeah, this, uh, I don't know why it spins like this. I kind of like it, though, you know? Just, just having some fun here. I'm getting a little bit of shrimp and some of this. I don't know what this red stuff is. Oh, it's like, oh, it's some chili or something like that. Perfect. And then, you know what, why not? Why not? We're gonna throw a cucumber on there as well, just for good measure. Hmm. That hits the spot right about now. And I said, they got me up here on this hill. I'm far away from civilization. It's hard, it's hard to go get some food. <laughs> That's how they get you, but. Hmm, you said it's nice. You got a little bit of oil in there, but the noodles are like perfectly cooked. But yeah, it's very nice. Um, it's easier like this for the, for the tail, but the, and the egg is uh, fantastic as well. The yolk is nice and creamy. Like I said, this stuff isn't too spicy. So you really get to enjoy it. Nice steaming pile right there. Mm. I like how there's always cucumbers. I like cucumbers a whole bunch. So it's nice to have a little bit of fresh snap with everything. You get to put everything together. Mm. I mean, I did end up paying, what was it, 68 ringgit? So probably a lot more than I ever would choose to, personally. Uh, like I said, here in Malaysia, you can get a nice, you know, just a meal just as big as this for three or four dollars, uh, or like 20 ringgit in the city. So you do pay a premium when you come out to these little isolated places, you know, the fancier resort areas. So I'm gonna finish up here with this tasty omelet. I love the onions, big fan of the onions. Um, I'm gonna finish up with this, and then next time you see me, I might be in a pool or something. I, I'm not entirely sure. 